Hello. This is one of my favourite stories. It's by John Agee and it's called The Incredible Painting of Felix Clouseau. The book has got some lovely pictures. Look at them really carefully. And also there's a bit of magic in this story. In Paris, the Royal Palace was holding its grand contest of art. From all over the city, painters came to show their pictures. One of them was the unknown painter named Félix Clouseau. All the great artists were there. Gaston de Stroganoff showed the king on his throne. Felicien Cafiolet showed the king on horseback. Alphonse Le Camembert showed the king in armour. Then Clouseau showed his painting. Outrageous, the judges cried. Never had they seen such a ridiculous painting. Then suddenly, Quack! A sound came from the painting. The judges were stunned. Clouseau was awarded the grand prize. They called him a genius. It was the first time in history a painting had quacked. But that was only half of it. Trousseau became famous. He was hailed from one side of Paris to the other. Even the king commissioned a painting. But soon there was trouble. A wealthy baroness owned a painting by Clouseau called The Sleeping Boa Constrictor. One night it awoke. In fact, Wherever there was a Clouseau canvas, there was chaos. The public was furious. There were damages. Somebody had to pay. So Clouseau was sent to prison. Clouseau's paintings were seized, all except one. Meanwhile, a notorious jewel thief was on the loose. All over Paris, diamonds, emeralds and sapphires were missing. One night, the thief broke into the king's palace to steal the crown. The next morning, to the king's surprise, he found the thief caught in the grasp of a ferocious dog. The crown was saved. Clouseau was a hero. He was awarded the Medal of Honour. Released from prison, he went back to his studio. and returned to his painting.